All right, so after spending way too many stones on the STR Videl banner, and finally pulling her on my last multi with a Whis animation, I feel like it's kind of mandatory now that we showcase the new and improved Pepe Gals team on Extreme Super Battle Road, just to see how much better this team is now with the improved leader skills, and also how much easier this stage is gonna be. Because if I remember correctly, the last time I did this stage, it was pretty tough, man. Like, it was a struggle. But now we have 170% leads compared to, you know, 120% leads from the Rebriands. So it should make a pretty big difference. So, uh, yeah, with all that said, let's jump right into it and see what happens. Now, obviously, if I can, I want to go for a no item run, but I don't think it's going to be possible, but we'll see. We'll see. You never know. So I'm going to try to be conservative with items. If I feel like I'm not going to die, then I won't use one. But if we, you know, look like we are going to die, then obviously I'll pop the item if I have to. So um, on this first rotation, we have the Rebrian, the Videl, and also the Khalifla. Um, let me check the defense. So... 128,000, not bad for Videl, 139,000 for Rebrianne, and about 90,000 for Khalifla. Now Khalifla should be getting dodges, so she's not a big deal, but uh, do I need to pop an item for <laughs> Videl and Rebrianne? Uh, I, I think we'll be okay. I think their defense will hold up, most likely. Yeah, okay, so let's go for Tien first. Uh, it'd be funny if we die in the first turn, which is possible. Definitely possible. I hope not, but we'll see. Okay, let's get it. Yo, Videl, give me a few dodges here, please. There's one. Oh, God. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> oh, my God. Yo, that was close, man. <laughs> that was close. I remember these guys hit pretty hard. So if we, <laughs> if we took a super there on the first turn... I'm pretty sure we were going to die. I'm pretty sure we were going to die. So uh, that was a close call. But, you know, it, it's a good thing because it added a little bit more drama to, uh, to the video. Okay. So no, no item run confirmed. Okay. We're popping a princess snake at least next turn. <laughs> That's for sure. Oh uh, man, I should have known. I should have known. I mean, it's still extreme super battle road at the end of the day, right? So like, <laughs> even though we have a much better team, uh, it's still going to be hard. Yeah, it's still going to be hard. So I'm going to go for the princess snake so we can heal back to full. And the good thing is Goku is sealed. So I don't have to worry about his attacks, but let's um, let's try to take out one of these guys as quickly as possible. I think uh, it makes the most sense to go for Tien, so let's try to kill him first. And with the launch, we should be able to do some good damage to him. So here we go. Yo, launch, give me those four supers. Uh, I want at least like two supers from Kaelin Khalifla. I want three supers from Videl. Come on. That's two. I mean, that's guaranteed, though. I need that third extra super. Damn it. Ugh, it's okay. It's all good. All right. <clears throat> so, so far, we're not off to a terrible start. Uh, I think it could have been better, right? But, I mean, at the same time, it could have been a lot worse. Because if we took that first super, like now, after seeing how much damage Rebrand took, I'm convinced that Videl would have died if uh, the Goku super had landed. So... Uh, yeah, it could have been a lot worse. And one thing to note, of course, is that, like, Adele is not going to be in her optimal state on this team, right? Because in order to get her unit super attack and also get her um, active skill, you need to have a Gohan on the team or, like, a Saiyan man on the team. So, obviously, we can't fulfill that condition since there's no Gohans on Peppy Gals. <laughs> Even though, like, for the second year anniversary, there was that, like, LR Gohan Pepe Gauss banner. Um, 
he's not a Pippi Gals, unfortunately. So yeah, we can't get her unit super attack. We can't greatly raise attack with every super. But nonetheless, her damage has so far been pretty good, in my opinion. And uh, yeah, she's not looking too bad. So I think what I'm going to do is put Rebrand there. Uh, mm, actually, hold on, let me think. Because Goku is attacking a lot in the first slot. And Videl can't dodge those attacks after she attacks. So, but, but then I want to kill Tien. I can't believe Tien's still alive. This guy should be dead right now. This guy has like a slip. He has like 0.1% HP. Okay, uh, let's, let's go for the Icarus. Safety first. Okay, as I said, man, if I feel like I'm not going to die, I won't use it, but I kind of feel like I'm going to die, so <laughs> I got to use it. Okay, so let's uh, let's kill Tien, and then I guess we'll go for Goku. Um, no, actually, we should have sealed Goku. Oh, that was a mistake. You know what, though? I'm not going to do the whole reset thing. I, I, I recognize I messed up. Pretty bad, but we're gonna live with our mistakes, okay? <laughs> we're gonna live with our mistakes, and we're not gonna do the reset thing so that nobody calls me a cheater. Even though I don't feel like resetting your game to reset your rotation is actually cheating. I feel like it's part of the game. I've said this multiple times now. You know, like if they didn't want you to do it, they would have removed the ability for you to do it. But uh, that's just me, you know? That's just me. Now, watch. We're gonna get supered. We're gonna take a lot of damage. We're not gonna die though. Cause I think with the Icarus. Oh. Oh. Okay. All right. I. I didn't think she was gonna tank that well. But all right. I mean, we didn't get supered either, which is nice. If we had gone supered, that would have been probably like maybe 50 to 100k. But um, I keep forgetting that Videl actually raises her defense right on her super. So. When she double supers, she's actually getting a lot of extra defense. Okay, cool. So uh, why don't we keep this Kale and Khalifa rotation? Uh, let me see. Okay, no, so what we're gonna what we're gonna do is put Khalifa there to dodge both of those attacks, and then that's a nice 24k super. And then Videl still has the high chance to dodge in the last slot. So just in case Goku doesn't die, we have a 50% chance to dodge. So, hopefully she does that. <sighs> okay, so yeah, of course. Dodge. Another dodge coming. Beautiful. Man, Tech Khalifa, I gotta say, man. I just gotta show her a little bit of love here, because legitimately, she is one of the most useful units in the entire game. I mean, she just has so much functionality. Like, there's so many enemies in the game that... She gets guaranteed dodge against, right? So like, she's just so useful, man. I mean, of course, like just recently with the anniversary, like she was the MVP for the God event. She helped you so much in like staying alive, right? Like getting those guaranteed dodges, literally saving your life. So uh, shout out to Tech Khalifa. That's all I gotta say. Shout out to Tech Khalifa. And on this phase too, he's gonna be getting the dodges with the Vegeta there. So. Uh, yeah, I'm glad I brought her. Definitely glad she's on this team right now. Okay, we got the double transformation. Um, let me see. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna put launch in the middle. That that attack from Vegeta should be fine. Uh, we're still gonna pop. Actually, do we need to pop anything? What if Krillin supers us? That's a concern. If Krillin supers us. You know what? I'm a truster. I I trust my 55% Fidel. She's going to do it. She's going to get us those dodges. So let's go for Gohan here. Uh, switch it over to Vegeta for launch. And then I probably should seal. I guess I'll seal Vegeta. Yeah, let's seal Vegeta. Okay. So as long as the first
Okay. I was gonna say, as long as the first slot doesn't have any supers, <laughs> we'll be okay. And of course, we get supered immediately. So that's wonderful. Love to see it, man. And Videl, for some reason, forgot how to dodge, which is nice. Um, we had, what, three attacks before she attacked? So that was, yeah, three chances to dodge, 50% chance to dodge, no dodges. That's great. Love to see it. It's okay. It's okay. We're still alive. That's all that matters. We're still going. Yep. And uh, Ribrian doing some good tanking, so it's going to be okay. Got the Icarus support item too. Or support memory, rather. Um, let me think. Uh, I think what I'm going to do is this. I am going to heal back a little bit. Let's actually use a uh, Aether here. Let's heal back to full. And uh, Kale should have some really good tanking with the guaranteed guard. So let me see. Let's go for Gohan. Yeah, let's go for Gohan. Because we should be able to do some good damage with the uh, LR. And obviously type advantage against Krillin. So there you go. All right, so Kale should be taking, yep, almost no damage. Shout out to Kale too. Shout out to Kale too. On on events where like you don't get the guaranteed dodge, um, you know Kale is definitely better. But Khalifa, like it's just yo, 100% chance to dodge is crazy. And against like so many different enemies in the game too, like there are just a lot of enemies that she can get guaranteed dodge against, which is why she's so amazing. Okay. Yep. Yep. Still still doing it. Yep. Perfect. And let's kill Gohan this turn. That would be ideal. I should get one more super, right? There we go. Okay, Gohan's dead. Gohan is dead. So, so far, it's been, um, <clears throat> I would say okay. I would say decent, you know. Uh, I was expecting maybe a little bit more dominance. I was expecting maybe to, uh, to crush these stages a little bit easier, but... Uh, you know, it's been so long since I've done Extreme Super Battle Road. I guess I forgot like how tough the stages could be, right? So I underestimated it a little bit. I gotta be honest, I, I did underestimate it a bit, but I can guarantee you right now, even though it's been a while since I've done uh, this stage specifically, we're, we're, we're going through it a lot faster than, uh, than we were before. Or at least a lot more efficiently, you know, a lot more easily, because... I remember the struggle, man. It was, it was a real struggle to to beat this stage the first time around. Like it took me a couple of tries. I don't know how many, maybe three or four. It was hard, basically. Um, let me think. <sighs> if Krillin supers us, that's gonna be a bad time. Um. You know what, hold on, this makes more sense. Putting the friend there makes more sense because she has more dupes. I think it's actually a 90% Videl. Yeah, damn, look at that. 90% Videl versus my um, 55%. So yeah, definitely gonna put her there. I, you know what, I'm, I could I could potentially kill, kill Krillin if we actually get some crits. So let's try to do that. Let's try to kill Krillin and maybe just avoid any potential super from Krillin. If we don't kill him though, I mean, after two or three supers, he should still be quite tanky from all the defense raises. Oh, he's dead. He, he's, he's dead. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. All right. Things are finally starting to shift in our favor, guys. But things are finally starting to turn around. If you're wondering why there's like, it seems to be some kind of banging noise upstairs. I think um, Phoenix is in music class or something. He's like banging on the drums. I'm not sure, but that's what that is. Okay, so, okay, yeah, but Gita should be dead too. Oh, no, never mind. Very close though. Very, very close. 
Um, yeah, let's finish off Vegeta with Kale, move on to the final stage. And uh, that's gonna be it, right? There's only three stages? Yeah, only three, only three. But it's been, it's been a good run, guys. I, I like this team a lot. Even though it's not like a top five team by any means, you know, it's not like one of the best teams in the game. It's definitely one of the most fun teams, in my opinion. And it's only gonna get better. Because if you guys missed it, yesterday, um, the details for five new Extreme Z Awakenings for Peppy Gals. Well, technically four, actually. Because Pan's not in there, but uh, the AGL Mai, the Infidel, the... Uh, who else? Uh, Fizz Bulma, and also... Who else was it? <laughs> oh my god, Tech Android 18. How did I forget about 18? That's the first one I should have thought of. That's my bad. My bad. I apologize. But, um, yeah, man, like, they're all getting easy A's. And, oh, hold on. Yeah, I am not putting a launch there. Okay, let's let's do this. And I th think I'm going to pop an Icarus still. Um, but yeah, all four of those getting easy A's. They all look amazing, too. Really, really good easy A's. So this Peppy Gods team is only going to get better and better. And, uh, you know, they're also releasing more Peppy Gods units at the same time. So, the future of this category is looking very, very good. So, even though it took me a lot more stones than I was hoping to spend to get this, uh, you know, get this Adele, I think it was worth it. In fact, in fact, I'm thinking about going back in for a dupe. I don't know if I'm going to. I'm, I'm just, it's just a, it's an idea, it's a concept right now, but you know, it's definitely tempting, man. It's definitely like the temptation is there, because she's really good, and I think she's a really fun unit too to run. Look at the damage! Whoa! Damn! Oh my God, yo! If she's going off, she's going off triple supers. And we killed Oolong, just like that. That was awesome. But, yo, this this just further reaffirms my, like, desire to get more copies, man. Because 55% is, she's good at 55%, for sure. She, she does well at 55%, but that one dupe makes such a massive difference. So, uh, I don't know. I'm on the fence about it right now. Yo, let me know in the comments what you guys think I should do, man. What do you guys think I should do? Should I go for the dupe? Should I stop being dumb and save for the worldwide celebration? Um, I need some advice, guys. So, so yeah, let me know. Let me know what I should do. Because I clearly have no self-control, you know? So, <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, you know what? This has been the Videl show so far, and we're going to let it continue to be the Videl show. Let's uh, use her to kill Roshi. And we should make pretty quick work of Yamcha once we do that with the, the Kale and Khalifla. Ooh, double dodges. No dodge there, but very good tanking. Getting super dodge. Oh my god, Yo, wow. Oh, that was clutch. That was super clutch. Ah, oh, man. Yeah, I think we're going for another dupe, man. I don't know. I think we have to. <laughs> I think we have to. It also gives her a much higher chance of uh, the additionals, right? Once I get the dupe, give her the additionals. Um, right now, she does have level 5 additional from skill orbs, but it's not enough for me. I, I need more. I need more. Alright, so this should do it. And I, I believe this is going to be our fastest time by far on this, uh, on this stage. Let's find out. Because obviously, I don't remember my last time, but... This should definitely be a record. Has to be. Oh yeah, there we go. 18 minutes, 15 seconds. My last time was 24 minutes and 58 seconds. So we saved almost seven minutes, guys. That's 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 big. That's huge. Uh, and we used four support items, which uh, you know, all things considered, isn't too bad, right? Four support items. We still have half our support items. So. Uh, I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. And there you guys go. Shout out to, I missed the name actually, but shout out to that guy for <laughs> the assist in the showcase. And uh, there you have it guys. STR of Adele leading 
the Pepe Gals team, uh, very much improved, man. A much, much better team now, obviously. And like I said, only going to get better, so I'm excited for the future of this category. I'm glad I got Videl. Probably look forward to another <laughs> summoning video for her in the near future. Maybe this afternoon. Who knows? And um, yeah, that's all I got to say, man. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that notification. No. Hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too. So that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.